Welcome to This Week from the Lewis Rubiter Library in beautiful Harupa Valley, California. We are looking at This Week for October 25th through the 31st for 2020. Welcome back. Happy last week of October birthdays to author Ann Tyler, born on the 25th of October 1941. To author Stephen Kellogg, born on the 26th of October 1941. To author Sylvia Plath, born on the 27th of October 1932. To author Evelyn Waugh, born on the 28th of October 1903. To author Dominic Dunn, born on the 29th of October, 1925. To poet Ezra Pound, born on the 30th of October, 1885. And to poet John Keats, born on the 31st of October, 1792. These books and many others by these authors may be found in our system. Please log on and request your copy today. Some famous events from this week. On the 25th of October, 1940, Benjamin O. Davis Sr. becomes the first African-American general of the United States Army. On the 26th of October, 1892, Ida B. Wells publishes Southern Horrors, Lynch Law in all its phases. This is the first formal publication on the history of lynching in the United States. On the 27th of October, 1954, two days and 14 years after his father, Benjamin O. Davis Jr. becomes the first African-American general of the United States Air Force. On the 28th of October, 1942, the Alcan or Alaska Highway is finally completed at Dawson Creek. It is connecting the territory of Alaska with the 48 contiguous states through British Columbia and Yukon territories as part of the war effort during the Second World War. The highway is still traversable today. On the 29th of October, 1967, the 1967 World's Fair, Expo 67, closes having over 50 million visitors at their site in Montreal, Canada. This was considered a dress rehearsal for the 1976 Olympics in Montreal, Canada. On the 30th of October, 1938, Orson Welles broadcasts his production of H.G. Wells' The War of the Worlds, on radio, and it was scary enough for many Americans throughout the United States and even some Canadians who heard the broadcast to think that it was actually a real invasion. Powerful, very much, happens to be any production that gets our attention like that. On the 31st of October, 1864, in the midst of the American Civil War, Nevada becomes our 36th state. Books on these incidents, events, and persons may be found also in our system. Please log on and request your copies today. Let us celebrate October 2020 as Head Start Awareness Month. And as a public library system, we are very aware of how much we help in early childhood education, much like Head Start. The week of the 25th through the 31st of October is National Red Ribbon Week. Show your solidarity and wear your red ribbon today. The 25th of October is International Artist Day. Support your local artists. The 26th of October is National Pumpkin Day. The 27th of October is World Day for Audiovisual Heritage 
in which we support the audiovisual arts and recordings of our past, present, and future. The 27th of October is also National Black Cat Day. Please be kind to black cats. The 29th of October is World Internet Day. and We support internet usage. The 29th of October is also National Hermit Day. The 31st of October is Halloween. It is also National Trick or Treat Day. You want to focus on a specific activity. The 31st is also National Knock Knock Joke Day. Be careful when you answer that door. They may have a joke for you. And the 31st is also National Doorbell Day, as trick-or-treaters on Halloween, rather than offer you a knock-knock joke, may just ring your doorbell. From the Riverside County Library System, we wish you all to have a great week.